This August occasion, I believe, marks an important milestone in the annals of the core signals of the Ghana Armed Forces and also symbolizes a new beginning to enhance capacity building in modern communications and technology in warfare. Today, a new direction for the partnership between the Ghana Armed Forces and the German Armed Forces Technical Advisory Group, GAFTAC, is being defined. An agenda that will contribute immensely to the objective of transforming and resourcing the core signals and the Ghana Armed Forces as a whole. The end state will be the provision of efficient, reliable, and timely communication support within the command framework of the Ghana Armed Forces. Today, the Signals Training School is the latest beneficiary with the provision of an ultra-modern two-story office and classroom stroke laboratory complex to enhance training and capacity building in modern military communication. I am reliably informed that this is the first phase of GAFTAC support to the Signals Training School, which will culminate in the installation of electronic and cyber warfare laboratories, as well as training support and exchange program in line with the short to medium term project for the next four years. Countries within the ECOWAS subregion have continued in a fight to deal with the instability that is sadly blighting the lives of thousands and shedding innocent blood. It is however worthy of note that the successful implementation of the Accra Initiative involving the consistent collaboration and cooperation of security and intelligence heads from Ghana and her neighbors, namely Cote d'Ivoire, Burkina Faso, Togo, Benin, Mali, and other partners seek to enhance the fight against terrorism in our region. This has helped Ghana to reinforce the security of its northern borders against infiltration. Hence, the German government's support in the Accra Initiative through the provision and establishment of the mobile headquarters in Tamale is highly appreciated. This will greatly enhance the command and control hub of the multinational joint task force headquarters and by extension, the ECOWAS standby force to coordinate efficiently and effectively in dealing with the mirage of threats and other emerging ones confronting it. As we commission this new edifice today, it is my firm belief that the Signals Training School, in collaboration with the Department of Defense, Communication and Information Systems, and the Ghana Armed Forces Training and Doctrine Command, will develop strategies to ensure optimum use of this facility to enhance training in cyber and electronic warfare, which is very crucial in fighting terrorism and other forms of modern warfare. Let me take this opportunity to commend the staff of the school for varying the initial plan to include a rooftop training area and a training tower mast as part of the school project. Mm -hmm.